Uh, hello, Matt. Hope you and your family are doing well during this uh, pandemic situation. Are you okay? I am good. How are you? Everything's great here in Puerto Rico so far. Uh, Matt, I had the opportunity to witness your NXT debut previously on Stanford, Florida. It was on September 21st at 8.02 p.m. You went out of that curtain and you faced Fabian Eichner. I was there in person. And everyone was so impressed with what this MMA guy, as many of them in the crowd described, and was doing at the moment. To you, to the human being, to Matthew Riddle, what does NXT mean to you? I mean, you know, for me, NXT kind of just like the independence in a wrestling to Matthew Riddle, I think it means a second chance. You know, I, like you said, a lot of people are like, look at this MMA guy, this UFC fighter, this and that. And I think, like, you were there that day. I think what I showed every fan in there and every person in there is I'm not just an MMA guy. I'm probably one of the best pro wrestlers. One of them. One of them. One of the best sports entertainers in the world. And I'm not just an MMA guy that used his name or fame for that to get here. You know, I put a lot of hard work in. And you can't be good in NXT. NXT, you can't just be a big name and people are like you. You have to be good at professional wrestling. You have to want it. You have to need it. And I think the fans of Sanford saw it that day. And I think throughout time, you know, the producers and everybody else at WWE saw that I wasn't just another MMA fighter trying to collect the check. I was a I was a pro wrestler and a fighter, and it was almost like a perfect hybrid, and uh, and that's what I've been going for my whole life. And I think that's what NXT means to me. It was my second shot to show the world what I could really do.